To connect Apple Pencil first generation to any iPad Air, I will start with if your iPad Air natively supports the pencil, you just pop off the lid like this, and then you plug in the Apple Pencil into your iPad. Patiently wait a couple of seconds. You should see the pair prompts. It may say turn on Bluetooth first, tap that, then tap on pair and unplug your Apple Pencil. You connect it to your iPad every time you want to charge it. Now, if your iPad does not support Apple Pencil 1, then we will have to do a hacky workaround. This will require you do own an old iPad which does support the pencil. So on that old iPad, we will start in the settings and we'll go to the Bluetooth settings. And so we do need to pair our old iPad. It can be any iPad as long as it can pair with Apple Pencil 1. Once it's connected, tap on the eye in the Bluetooth settings and forget the device. This may sound like a step you can skip. If you don't, the next steps won't work. So the next step is we're gonna open the App Store and then search for and download the Light Blue app. This is completely free. Now, we will need to get a USB-C to Apple Pencil adapter. This can be bought on Apple's website or you can use a cheap one on Amazon, but the Amazon ones may not work. So we're gonna plug our charging cable into the iPad, and then the other end of the charging cable into the adapter, then we'll connect the Apple Pencil to the adapter, but there's more, because we will see accessory not supported, as this adapter was made for a completely different model of iPad. But these next steps will still work, so tap OK, and then open the light blue app. So you should see Apple Pencil show up, and if it doesn't, we'll just swipe down to refresh and give it a couple of seconds. So if you don't see it here, scroll down and you may need to restart your iPad. So please watch the full thing now to the very end so you can make sure that this is always going to work. So you tap on Apple Pencil and then it's going to try and connect. Now if any parts here don't work, you have to unpair from your old iPad. We will enter the passcode one, two, three, four. When we tap on pair, it will pair, but there is still more to this video, so please keep on watching. So once we tap on pair, well, the Apple Pencil will now work now, and literally every feature you would want is fully working. When we want to charge our Apple Pencil first generation, the pencil will stop working on this iPad. So if you need to constantly have the pencil working, I'm going to break the pencil, so you can see it's not working anymore. What you do is you open settings and head to the Bluetooth settings. Then you locate your Apple Pencil and you have to forget the device on the iPad Air. Then you have to repeat the same procedure, do this all again, and now your Apple Pencil will work always.